Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm actually going to resolve if when you're pressing the escape key on your keyboard on Windows 11, it opens up the start menu instead. So this should hopefully be a pretty straightforward process on how to resolve it. And without further ado, let's go ahead and jump right into it. So first thing I recommend doing would be to open up the search menu, type in troubleshoot. Best result should come back with troubleshoot settings. Go ahead and open that up. And on the right side, you want to go ahead and select where it says Other Troubleshooters. So go ahead and left click on that. And then you want to scroll down underneath Other and then select the Keyboard Troubleshooter. So go ahead and select Run. And again, hopefully that should have resolved the problem if you had one here. Something else we can try here as well would be to disable the sticky keys on our computer. So in order to do that, all you have to do is close out of here. Open up the Search menu. Take the Control Panel. Best match, you'll come back with Control Panel, so go ahead and open that up. Set your View By to Category View, and then you want to select Ease of Access. You want to select the Ease of Access Center, and now you want to scroll down to where it says Make the Keyboard Easier to Use. And then if it says Turn On Sticky Keys, so this is turned on right here, you want to go ahead and disable it. So go ahead and uncheck this box to turn it off if it's currently turned on. And then you select Apply and OK. You can also try swapping out your keyboard because there certainly could be an issue with your keyboard. The keys are stuck, perhaps. Or it might be a really old and worn out keyboard you're using. So it could be a mechanical or hardware failure, perhaps, and not a software-based issue, in which case a software tutorial like this would not apply for you. But definitely everything I show in this tutorial is worth trying. And as always, thank you for watching this brief tutorial. Do hope I was able to help you out, and I do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.